Hello, and welcome to Annual Pool's How-To Guide section. Today, we will be going over the steps on how to replace a diverter valve. Most damaged valves can be repaired by replacing the diverter valve assembly inside the valve body. However, the valve body may occasionally break and will need to be completely replaced. This guide shows how to replace a single diverter valve. Step 1. Purchase parts. Buy a replacement valve to have on hand when you need to replace a complete valve assembly. Step 2. Turn off power to the pull pump. Relieve the pressure in the lines by turning the relief valve on top of your filter counterclockwise. Step 3. Cut out valve. If you have a three-way diverter valve, you will have to cut each of the three pipes attached to the valve. Make sure you have enough room on each pipe to add in a straight connector and short pipe to reconnect each line. Allow for three quarters of an inch overlap into the valve and three quarters of an inch overlap into each end of the connector. Step four, file off the rough edges on the ends of the three pipes that were just cut. Glue the straight connectors onto each of the three pipes. Step 5. Cut three short pipes to fit between each of the valve ports and their respective connectors. Make sure to make each pipe one and one half inch longer to overlap into the valve and connector. File the rough edges off both ends of each of these three short pipes. Step 6. Remove valve assembly. As a precaution, remove the eight screws on top of the new valve and lift out the diverter valve assembly. This will prevent any glue from accidentally getting onto the valve assembly when you glue in the short pipes. Step 7. Glue each short pipe into its valve port and connector. You will have to spread the piping a little to force the last pipe in. Wait two hours for the glue to dry before turning on the pump. Step 8. Replace valve assembly. Insert the diverter valve assembly into the valve and tighten it down with the eight screws. Make sure the valve assembly is inserted the same way as it was with the inlet label positioned on the middle of the port where the water comes in. If you insert the valve any other way, you run the risk of shutting off water to this valve. You have now successfully replaced your diverter valve. If you have any additional questions, please feel free to call us toll free at 1-877-372-6038 or visit us online at www.nyopools.com.